We all get knocked down. In every aspect of life. You're gonna fall flat on your face. You're gonna be criticized when you come out into the arena called life. You're gonna feel awkward and stupid and dumb sometimes. But it's okay. It goes with the territory. You got to get messed up sometimes. You got to get dirty. You got to get your feelings hurt. You got to get disappointed. You got to get told no. You going to ask somebody for some money. He going to tell you no. That's just dirt. See, you get tripped out because you got dirt on you. But you need dirt on you to develop. Because dirt ain't just dirt. Dirt is fertilizer. Dirt is nutrients. Dirt gives you the strength for your seed to push through. See, you gotta have dirt on you to push through something. Everything you see that's beautiful starts out as a seed, but that seed got to get dirt on it. See, you get mad when haters come your way. You get mad cause you get a setback. You get mad cause you get thrown off course. You get mad cause you get a detour. That's just dirt. You get mad cause they talking about you. That's dirt. You get mad because you, you lost your mama. That's dirt. But show me something that has grown into something beautiful that didn't have no dirt on it. You got to have dirt on you to grow into what God got for you. And maybe you've been knocked down in your life and it seems like, hey, the fight is over. It is not over unless you quit. You have to learn to turn and look at every obstacle as an opportunity. Everybody wants to prize, but nobody loves the process. Everybody wants to be a champion, but nobody's willing to put in the work that it takes to be a champion. Everybody wants to hold up the trophy and say, man, I did it, but nobody's willing to put in the work that it takes to do it. I love the process. I love the thought of working for what I want. And I firmly believe you're never supposed to wish for it more than you're willing to work for it. Your expectations are never supposed to exceed your effort. But a lot of people, they wish, and they're not willing to work. And the great thing about life, life has a funny way of testing all of us and seeing how bad we really want what it is that we say we want. When you work for something, it gives you a different type of attachment to it. The harder you work, the harder it is to surrender. That's why cats can give up so easy. They ain't got nothing invested. But when a cat work for some, like when a cat been sacrificed for some, well, you're going to have a cold day in hell before you take it from him. You can't be good and be a legend. You can't be great, really, and be a legend. You got to be phenomenal. I want you to push for legend. It is the process of the grind that shapes you and forms you. It's not the game. You think you become a champion on the field? You don't. You become a champion when ain't nobody watching you. You're doing your own drills and your own way. You're doing what coach tell you to do and you're doing your own stuff. You become a champion in the dark when ain't nobody looking. You don't become no champion when you put no dog on helmet on. You become a champion the way you eat. You become a champion the way you think. You become a champion in your grind. When nobody knows what you're doing, when you're putting in those extra reps, when you're watching those videos and you're getting inspired, when you change your music and you just get on stage and you shine, it's the process that makes you sweet.